This demonstration is taking place on the 8th anniversary of the ban, 8 years of state sanctioned discrimination against LGBTI people and it's so fantastic to see so many people out here today taking a stand for equal rights. A lot of people say, oh you should be happy with civil unions or you should be happy with a registered relationship. But that's missing the point. I'm here, standing here with Sue Penicu, who's one of our representatives in the state parliament. And I want to just talk to you a bit about what's going on politically around the country. As you've heard, we've got a bill in the House of Representatives, and my colleague, uh, Green Senator Sarah Hanson Young, has got a bill in in the Senate. We have those bills there, and we are wanting to build up the pressure to the point where we are going to get enough members of parliament to come and vote with us to once and for all remove discrimination from our marriage laws and we are making progress. A few weeks ago the committee reported into the, one, into the bills that are in the House of Representatives. More than a quarter of a million people responded. 64% said it is time to end discrimination in our marriage laws. The mood in the Australian population has changed and people are very relaxed about two people who love each other, getting married, regardless of their gender or their sexuality. And it's about time the rest of the members of parliament caught up with the Australian public. And we're not going to just push for the change federally. Sue Penicu's got a bill here in the Victorian parliament. And it's my hope that if Tasmania can change its laws and the ACT can change its laws, then Victoria can as well. So today I encourage you all to go back to your workplace on Monday and ensure that your union, so your union is doing everything they can to support marriage equality. I recently had to write a timeline of all the things that have happened in the last eight years and it's incredible the changes that we've seen. We have seen the majority of Australians going from not supporting marriage equality, it was about 34% eight years ago, and now we see a majority of Australians support marriage equality. So our fighting has meant that we've seen the majority of Australians change their position in support of marriage equality. Australia is now ready for marriage equality, but it's about time that the government got with the times and got with where the majority of Australians stand on this issue and grant us our equal rights.